Hey guys, Lost Scotsman here. Just thought I would do this other video about the EU UK business. I've come to you from a lovely mountain stream. I've just uploaded a video, as you can probably see, about cell towers. <sighs> I just don't know guys. I think it's they're causing a lot of problems. I'm just going to try and just give us a sec here. The zoom's quite in. There we go. I'm not using my GoPro today because... I uh, use that in the car only. I'm just using my cell phone and my selfie stick. Yes, I'm not wearing my hat. My hat's in my pocket. I've just climbed up a hill. It was quite steep. It took me an hour and a half and I'm very warm. So I thought I'd bring you a wee walk through this woods. And believe this or not, there's a cell tower just over there, right? But by the time I get to this middle bit, which is 100 feet away, it's as if it's a black zone. No, nothing, no frequencies, nothing can get in up here. My phone doesn't work, nothing works. Mysteries, eh? Mysteries of the universe. Anyway, guys, let's talk about the EU. <sighs> what can we start? Boris is meant to seal, sign a deal for tonight. If it doesn't happen, it's getting delayed again. I mean, this is getting ridiculous, guys. Is this him? Wait, your vote doesn't account for anything nowadays. It doesn't. I mean, what's going to happen? Here's a scenario for you. Imagine Northern Ireland, right? Voted to leave the UK. And they turned around and says, no, it's not going to happen. They kept doing what they're doing now. There'd be a bloody civil war over there. Just because of the Irish backstop. I mean... Oh, come on, guys. This is just getting ridiculous now. We need to leave. It's it's getting to the point now where people are just saying, oh, just let them keep. Let's just stay in the EU. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. I'm sticking by my guns. But that's that. Boris is getting pushed. I mean, the people that's round about Boris, I mean, they're idiots. Boris, right, a lot of people have says to me, they support Boris, like, look, I like, right, see the guy Boris, right, I don't particularly like him, right, I think he's a bit of an idiot, right, they're all idiots, they're all needing to take out that Houses of Parliament, we're all needing a new set of government, it's all needing refreshed, but that's not going to happen, guys, we're stuck with these dicks, right, that's just, that's a clear and simple case, we're stuck with them, unless we all march up there and remove them by force, which will not happen in Britain, because we're, t that's the way we are. Maybe, maybe it will happen, eventually, if everybody gets pissed off enough. But guys, that's all I see in the tele TV, the telly, I was going to say there's an old term for you, TV nowadays, I mean, I don't even watch mainstream news anymore, because of the sheer rubbish that comes out of their mouth. I mean, they're basically saying, oh, we need to stay in the EU, it's got to be apocalyptic, we're going... The best one was the Scottish one. They were putting, uh, they put a news article out that Scotland will run out of water within a couple of weeks if we leave the EU without a deal. It, I mean, are these guys taking drugs or something? Probably are. It rains here ninety percent, the ninety-eight percent of the time. I mean, it's dry right now, right? But it's the rain for the next two weeks. Seemingly, it's coming in. But I know you like the the beautifulness of Scotland, so I thought I'd bring you a walk up here today. Plus, it's very it's very relaxing in here. You'll hear the odd fighter jet flying over when they're practicing. But anyway, guys, let's get back to the point. I don't personally think we'll leave. We need to leave. We need to leave on the date that said we're leaving. But I think it's going to get, it's going to get thrown out one day, guys. It's going to be like, oh, let's just cancel it for another year. Then that will come, and then well, let's cancel it for another year, and eventually it will just fade away into the into the, the beyond, and it will end up we're no leaving. Right. As I say, I hope we leave at the end of this month. I pray we leave at the end of this month. But they're not going to allow it, guys. The EU will not allow it. 
do you know even if we leave the EU, now that's if we leave the EU, the British army still have to fight for the European army? I kid you not. I was reading an article on it yesterday. They've signed the, they've already signed the treaty with them, basically saying if the EU army goes into battle, Britain, British army, have to help them, have to join them. <sighs> this world's this world's gone, guys. Look at the mushrooms everywhere. There's, there's mushrooms, crazy looking red mushrooms everywhere. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that or no, guys. I think that's what Boris needs to take before he goes and... I think we need to send him some mushrooms. You got know the magic mushrooms up here. You got all the strange people comes up here and takes the mushrooms. You can see them all growing in the woods behind me. But anyway guys, to be honest with you, I think all the people in the Houses of Parliament are taking magic mushrooms. Because they're all idiots. We're needing a total clean out. That'll no happen though. The British people are no... That's the thing now, guys. There's, there's, so, there's only a couple of years left. So many thousand years left in the in Britain now. And that's the point of what I'm trying to make. We're willing to do it. But you need more. You need an army. You need... You, to remove a government, you need thousands of people. No a couple of hundred. Standing at the Houses of Parliament, waving their flags. Aye, it's a great thing. Aye, they're doing a great thing for the country. But the problem is, there's no enough is. People are scared. <laughs> I, I mean, it, it's ridiculous here. I was talking to some old people, right? And they're like, oh, it's terrible, son. It's terrible. And this is what's terrible. Oh, the man came in my door and he was talking to the... <laughs> this is, kid you not, the SNP were at their door, right? But obviously, they're voting. Oh, and the SNP man told me, if we leave the EU without a deal... I'll have no medicine within a couple of days and my water will go off. And now that's what they're doing to old people. They're scaremongering them. <laughs> you can't make that stuff up, guys. You really can't, eh? Thought there was somebody behind me up there. There's a lot of deer up here. Stags. Here, yeah, Tracy, if you're watching, there's a lot of like stags and deer up here. There's, I can't see any of them now. They're probably because I'm talking. But you get them walking behind me sometimes there's a lot up here this is where they hunt it's a terrible thing but you know what I'm saying this is all forestry one day this will all get cut down for wood but it's got another 20 years left before that happens so thank god for that but anyway guys I'm going to eat, leave to this and I'll try and do a video tomorrow and I need to put my woolly hat back on because it's getting cold. I'm in the black spot. I can see the signal in my cell phone. Zero. Nothing. I'm in the black spot. Nothing works here for some really weird reason. Nothing works. Your, even a radio will not pick up a signal where I'm standing right now. Weird. There must be something in the ground. Iron or something in the ground. Shielding everybody. I think I'll move here. I'll put my tent right in the middle of the road. <laughs> my lips are red. The Chris and Allen show should be back on Friday, but I'm meant to be going uh, with someone to do some ghost hunting. So we'll see what happens there. We'll maybe put some videos up. So if there's any breaking news, I'll stick some videos up tomorrow. And I hope you all have a great day, guys, in this hellish world we live in. Right, catch you later, guys. Jessie says goodbye to you. She's away chasing after a rabbit, I think. I don't know where she's there. She's up there somewhere. You can see her. But anyway, guys, catch you later. I need to walk back to try and get a signal to upload this. Catch you later, guys. Bye.